The revelation that we are discussing is very astounding and it has the potential to disrupt the fundamental foundation of social security as we see it today. Now is the time to grab some popcorn and settle in, because you won't want to miss a single second of this shocking revelation. What's up, everyone? This is your return to the stimulus updates. In order to obtain the most recent information and updates regarding economic stimulus measures, you will go to channel. I am Ali, your host, and I am pleased to inform you that we have some very exciting news to share with you today. However, before we go into the updates for today, make sure that you click the option to subscribe and that you activate the notification bell. This will ensure that you are never left behind in terms of any information concerning stimuli. During these trying times, we are here to keep you informed and to give you the power to make decisions. Let's get right down to business, shall we? I have some sensational information to share with you today that is going to shake up your perception of the benefits that are provided by Social Security. We are talking about a staggering $23 billion that is currently up for grabs. It is about to become a topic of discussion in the media. To answer your question, why should you be devoted to your mailbox in the days, weeks, and months that are to come up? Mainly due to the fact that this $23 billion bonanza is causing a stir, and you can be one of the fortunate recipients of this bounty. Yes, you read that correctly. Uncovering the enigma that lies behind this enormous amount is the primary topic of the video that we have now. All right, let's get started. So what exactly is the deal with this staggering windfall of $23 billion? Do you inquire? Now fasten your seatbelts because the Social Security Administration is on a mission to make sure that every penny gets returned to the person who is legally entitled to receive it. And what do you think? You could very well be one of those people. The time has come for those of you who are receiving fixed income benefits, whether it be retirement, disability, survivor, spousal, or SSI benefits, this is the moment you have been waiting for. Hold on to your hats, for there is a spin to this story. Beginning in the month of January 2022, the benefits that are provided to people with fixed incomes will see a considerable boost. This raise is a welcome relief for a great number of individuals and families who have been encountering difficulties in meeting their financial obligations. The fact that this increase is not a one-time occurrence, but rather a permanent adjustment to ensure improved financial stability for individuals who rely on these benefits is something that should be taken into consideration on a regular basis. With that being said, the twist lies in the fact that cautious financial planning is required. In spite of the fact that the expansion of benefits is unquestionably a favorable trend, it is of the utmost importance to make well-informed selections regarding the most efficient techniques for managing this additional revenue. The following are some tips that will assist you in navigating this twist. 1. Determine your requirements. Spend some time analyzing your existing financial condition and determining the areas in which the increased income can have the most significant impact on your living situation. First and foremost, you should give priority to critical expenses like housing, healthcare, and basic requirements. Being aware of your requirements enables you to make more informed choices regarding the distribution of your financial resources. 2. Produce a financial plan. Establishing a comprehensive budget is essential to the successful management of your financial resources. Take into account your monthly income, which should include the higher benefits, and evaluate it in relation to your various expenditures. This will make it possible for you to determine areas in which you may save money or invest the additional funds in a prudent manner. 3. Pay off any outstanding bills. If you have obligations that are still due, you might want to think about utilizing some of the enhanced benefits to pay off those debts. By lowering the amount of debt you have, you can improve your overall financial health and possibly reduce the amount of interest you have to pay over the course of the loan. Create a fund for unexpected expenses. Having a financial safety net in place is usually a good idea, especially in the event that unforeseen bills or crises arise. When you receive extra benefits, you might want to think about putting some of them into an emergency fund. Having access to this cash can assist you in navigating unanticipated events without requiring you to rely on loans or credit cards. 5. Consult with a qualified professional. When you are unsure of how to best handle your higher benefits, you may want to consider obtaining advice from groups that specialize in assisting persons who are on fixed incomes or speaking with a financial counselor. The professionals in this field are able to offer individualized advice that is tailored to your specific circumstances and objectives. Remember that. A beneficial development is the increase in fixed income benefits nevertheless. It also necessitates careful planning and decision-making in order to properly implement. Taking the time to assess your requirements, developing a spending plan, and making decisions based on accurate information can allow you to make the most of this opportunity and improve your overall financial well-being. 
Legislators are getting ready to handle this enormous problem, which is estimated to cost $23 billion right from the start. Certainly, you did hear that correctly. When it comes to legislative activity, it is not something that happens every day. On the other hand, miracles do take place. Take into consideration the fact that recipients were overpaid to the tune of $23 billion. Now guys, that is a staggering number, and it is making quite a commotion in the community. Let's say you get a letter in your mailbox that informs you that you have been overpaid and that you now owe a significant amount of money. Do I have it right? This is a nerve-wracking situation. But there is no need to be concerned, my friends, you have choices. An appeal can be filed against the decision, and who knows? It's possible that they will cancel the entire sum. Getting this is like winning the lottery. This is when things become really interesting. Legislators are currently investigating the matter. A total elimination of this $23 billion mistake is being discussed as a potential solution. You did hear me right, it is correct. The idea of pressing the reset button and going forward without looking back is something that they are contemplating. It is the same as deleting a nightmare and beginning again from scratch. Consequently, what does this imply for you? In the event that you receive any message from Social Security, you should proceed to open it as soon as possible. Please remember that time is of the essence. You would not want to pass up any opportunities to appeal or find potential answers. But there is no need to be concerned because there are actions being taken to address these worries. One example of an organization that plays a significant part in maintaining economic stability is the Federal Reserve, which does so through the implementation of quantitative easing and interest rate policy. Despite the fact that these may appear to be band-aid fixes, in times of economic instability, they are essential to maintaining the economy's stability. However, why is it necessary to conduct yet another round of stimulation checks? The most important thing is to increase the amount of money that consumers spend and to stimulate economic activity. Studies have shown that those with low incomes are more inclined to spend their stimulus checks, which results in the injection of much-needed cash into the economy. This domino effect has the potential to have far-reaching advantages, including assistance to businesses in maintaining their operations and the creation of jobs. It is crucial, however, to be aware that the objective of these inspections is different from that of the checks that were performed in earlier rounds. Even while earlier checks were related to your OVID-19 alleviation initiatives, the focus now is on revitalizing the economy and alleviating the current financial hardship that many Americans are experiencing. Everything hinges on how the circumstance develops over the course of the next few months. Now, folks, that brings an end to today's activities. Always keep an eye out for any new information. Maintain your attention on the channel for additional exciting announcements. Take care of yourself and continue to be amazing till we meet again. Get you on the other side of the coin. The video lesson for today has come to an end. When I upload the next video, I shall see you all there. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed the video. There will be further videos uploaded in the near future.